More than 1,900 students are learning the value of helping others. 41 NBC's Carlisha Booz learned how the kids are helping rebuild communities in Macon and preparing them for the future. I get older and I get my own house, I'll be able to paint it because I know how. School may be out for the summer, but that isn't stopping kids from learning. Forest Hill United Methodist Church is hosting its 14th annual River of Life Mission Project. I just wanted to help people, um, and I've been looking forward to this for a long time, and it's my first year, and I enjoy it. It's a project where youth and adults repair homes for the needy and elderly. The homes are selected through a partnership with Rebuild and Macon. Some work includes painting, roofing, and carpentry. I did it last year, and it was really fun. And when you see the homeowners, they're always so grateful and happy, and it makes you feel good about what you're doing. The kids say they enjoy helping others, which motivates them to continue their mission. It feels really good because, like, when they when they see like the finished thing, they're always really like happy, and it just like because like I painted it, and it makes me feel really like happy because I helped them. Participants will spend three days working in neighborhoods throughout Macon. Crew leader Steve Peavy says if people in the community help each other more, less problems will occur. In, in the scriptures it says, do unto others as you'd have them do unto you. And he said the greatest commandment is to love your neighbor as you love yourself. And I feel like that's what we do here. He adds, the learning continues on this journey. Some of these kids have never held a paintbrush before. Some of them have never held a hammer or sawed a board. And they learn these skills while they're here. But I think the most important skill they learn is to love others around them. In Macon, Carlisha Booz, 41, NBC News. Forest Hill United Methodist Church has sponsored this mission project since 2003. Some of the neighborhoods that have been served are Bloomfield, East Macon, Montpelier, Tyndall Heights, and Unionville.